Hi, Cubbies. It's time for bear hug number three from your apple seed book. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm ready. Okay. Well, you know, Cubbies, God is the one who gives us day and night. And the Bible tells us about the very first day and the very first night. <gasps> And he tells us that in the very first book of the Bible, in the very first chapter, in the very first verse, it starts out in the beginning. God created the heavens and the earth. Is that your verse? I think it is. I bet you already know it. We will say it a few more times today. Okay. Well, everything in the Bible really and truly happened. And it's what God wants us to know. And there's a lot in the Bible to know about God. And we can read it from the time we are little to the time we are big to the time we are very, very, very old. Every day we can read the Bible and learn more about what God wants us to know. Okay? Before we go on, let's pray. Clap, 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 hands on your lap. Dear Lord, please help us to listen carefully to your Bible words and help us to learn about you and help us to um, come to know you and serve you and honor you and bring glory to your name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Well, in the beginning, before I was alive or you were alive or anyone was alive, there was God. G-O-D. God. We don't know what God looks like because God does not have a body like us. We only see his name written here. Do you see anything else in that picture? No, we don't see anything else. There's nothing there except God. Out of nothing, God created something. Out of nothing? Can you make something out of nothing? No, we need something to make something else, don't we? I can't make something out of nothing. No one can make something out of nothing, but God can, and God did. God created something in Genesis 1-1. Here in my Bible, it says, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. God is creator. He created everything. In the Bible, create means to make something out of nothing. Hmm, see? There's nothing in my hands. <laughs> Only God can make something from nothing, not me. In the beginning, the earth had no shape and it was covered with water. Oh my goodness. Nothing lived on the earth at this time. No cows, no kittens, no goldfish, no birds, no zebras, no trees, and no people. It was quiet and empty and dark. Cubbies, close your eyes. Close those eyes. Oh, when our eyes are closed, it is very dark. Would you like to live in a dark place like that? Hmm. Cubbies, keep your eyes closed. Hold your hands up in front of your face. Let me try. Can you see your hand? No, we can't see anything if it's dark. No, I can't see my hand. And unless you're peeking, you can't see yours. <laughs> So, in the beginning, it was just dark, 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 dark. And I lost my spot. Sorry about that. Okay. <laughs> I turned my paper over, and then I didn't see what I was supposed to see. I got confused because it was so dark. It's a good thing that God made light. <laughs> okay. Well, God didn't let it stay dark. He said, do you know what he said? He said, let there be light. And there was light. Open your eyes and see the light. Oh, here, here's some light. Ooh. <laughs> so God said, let there be light. And there was light. On day one, God created the light. He made the light out of nothing. All he had to do was say, let there be light. And there was light. Isn't that awesome? I couldn't do that. You couldn't do that. No one but God could do that. God saw that the light was good. He called the light. What do you think he called the light? 
day. And he called the dark, what do you think? Night. This was the very first day and the very first night. Can you hold up one finger? The very first day and the very first night? Yes, and our, ver our verse comes from the very first book of the Bible, the very first chapter, the very first verse. Do you remember what it is? In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Wonderful. On day two, God said, let there be a space above the water. He called that space the sky. <laughs> Can you hold up two fingers? On day two, God created the sky. Yes, the space above the water. Let's all stretch. Pretend we're outside and we see the giant blue sky above us. Oh, we could reach to the sky. <laughs> Well, we probably can't quite touch the sky, no, because it's so far up there. But up above us is the sky, and God created the sky. All right. God created everything, cubbies. He created the heavens and the earth. We live on the earth. This is the way the earth looks like from way, way, way up in the sky from space. Now, let's say our verse one more time. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. God is creator. I love the earth that God gave us. I am so glad that God is so creative. And we're going to learn more about the wonderful things that God created in our next lesson. Okay, I'll see you later. Goodbye, cubbies.